Saint Petersburg. The city was built by the Neva River to become the capital of Russian state for two centuries. Petersburg is the cultural capital of modern Russia, as well as a scientific center of worldwide significance. It's a city that always has known how to cultivate outstanding citizens. St. Petersburg natives include great poets and scientists, industrialists and musicians, athletes and people changing the course of history, politicians and top managers. In the heart of St. Petersburg, among its rivers and wide straight avenues, near the world-renowned cathedrals, historic and architectural attractions, near the confluence of the Fontanka into the Neva, on Lermontovsky Avenue is the main academic building of St. Petersburg University of Management and Economics. Financiers and economists, managers and lawyers, civil servants and administrative personnel for various industries are trained here for over 20 years. This new generation of highly skilled professionals will define Russia's future. Having taken the best features from the proven domestic system of higher education, we added to it modern classroom technologies and teaching methods to yield a new level of education quality. The university has seven schools – economics, management and information technologies, liberal arts and social sciences, law, international programs, pre-university education, additional professional education, e-learning. There are also several research and training centers. There are programs of training of supreme qualification human resource. 58 departments handle teaching in more than 80 fields of specialization and professions. Nine regional institutes and two missions of St. Petersburg University of Management and Economics cover the entire country from Kaliningrad to Magadan. Over 20,000 students annually get their higher education at the university. The university is especially focused on students' research, which initiates the innovative development of Russian economy. Student research societies are active in all schools. As of the date of this writing, they have been responsible for over 1,000 publications in scientific books and journals. Our students' research has won over 500 various awards and certificates of merit. Graduate students and postdoctoral researchers at the university have an opportunity to participate in collaborative research with 22 scientific and educational institutions, including those of Russian Academy of Sciences. The Russian Academy of Sciences included the university in the list of institutions acting on the scientific and methodological guidance of the academy. The university was granted the status of academic university. The automated system of remote learning, developed on the basis of university's researchers' work, was included in the program The 100 Best Projects of the City. Thanks to this program, students from the most remote regions have access to the latest educational software, online books and study guides, and the entire colossal educational database at the university. The formula for continuous success of St. Petersburg University of Management and Economics is simple. It's 3i – Integration, Innovations and Investments. One of the innovations is the system of continued education. Training of future students begins at the pre-college education school. It continues at the university, and then graduate school option is available. The university is accredited to grant advanced degrees.
many graduates return to alma mater having built a successful career to participate in the President's Program for Retraining Managerial Personnel or MBA programs at the Institute for Retraining and Continued Education for Executives. The goal of the university today is integration into the European and worldwide educational community. Students at the university are granted degrees at two levels, according to the Bologna Declaration, Bachelors and Masters. St. Petersburg University of Management and Economics is the member of the International Association of Universities. The university has partnerships with more than 80 largest universities in Europe, America, Asia and Australia. These include Harvard, Stanford, Yale, Princeton, Cambridge, Oxford, Sorbonne and more partnerships are established annually. An increasing number of exchange students and visiting professors study and teach at those institutions. In turn, the university hosts both foreign students and visiting professors and researchers as well. International cooperation allows students to obtain both Russian and foreign degrees simultaneously. That opens to them career paths at any point on the world map and makes them attractive for foreign-based employees operating in Russia. Forty of the professors at the St. Petersburg University of Management and Economics are full or corresponding members of Russian and foreign academies. 200 have national degrees above PhD and 690 have PhD degrees. The scientific research is led by the Academician Secretary of the Social Sciences Department of the Russian Academy of Sciences, Honorary Professor of the University Andrei Afanasyevich Kakoshin. Honorary professors are elected by the academic board from the leading personalities of global scientific and cultural communities, business and politics and greatly contribute to the education process. Academicians of Russian Academy of Sciences and Nobel laureates, including the foreign university sect, as scientific leaders and consultants at the university's department. Both the staff and the students are justifiably proud of the many prizes the university is awarded annually. Students are always students. Their vigorous energy supply is never completely spent in the classroom. There is always some left for arts and athletics. All important events at St. Petersburg University of Management and Economics are covered by manager newspaper. Besides that, the university also publishes the Economics and Management, Sociology and Law Proceedings journals, included in the list of editions recommended by the Russian Minister of Education and Sciences Supreme Attestation Commission. A study resort complex is located near Pushkin Lyceum, among the Tsar's residences of Pavlovsk and Tsarske Silo. The university continuously invests in social infrastructure. The complex has comfortable living quarters for one and two students per room, a concert hall, athletic complex, library, laundry, sauna, canteen and kitchen, Wi-Fi, internet access. Everything is done to provide the environment for adequate rest, engaging entertainment and comfortable preparation for study. The university students start the dialogue with future employers long before graduation. With the aim of arranging practical training for students, the university concludes numerous contracts with companies and organizations of St. Petersburg and Leningrad region. In the course of practical training, the students can improve their professional skills. As a result of implementing internal quality controls for educational process, the university graduates its students to be in higher demand in the labor market. Both Graduate Placement Service and Alumni Association assist with job searches, resume writing and contract negotiations.
At the university, there is the Careers and Employability Service, where education specialists, lawyers and psychologists assist up perform pupils in vacation guidance and searching for training place, give advices to the students from non-effective higher education institutions. In line with the Careers Service, the University Center incorporates a law office, innovation projects and IT center, business education and foreign languages center. Here, everybody can find an interesting occupation. You can listen to a lecture, participate in seminars, concerts, meetings with distinguished guests. Together with your friends, you can visit the Time Club to work on your project or browse the internet, to play table games or to take a cup of tea or coffee. St. Petersburg University of Management and Economics strives to provide its graduates with all the skills and knowledges necessary for the practical work, so she, he can make good contributions in the workplace from day one. From the day the university was founded, it is led by the permanent president Viktor Andreevich Gnivko, doctor of economic sciences, professor, full member of Russian Academy of Natural Sciences, distinguished professional educator of Russian Federation, distinguished scientist of Russian Federation. The main focus of our work is the efficiency of scientific research and the quality of education, investments in staff, educational assets, integration with research, innovations in education. That's the basis for our success. We are confident about the future. We are building a 21st century educational institution.